Those with weak immune systems, medical experts say it is not safe for you to go outside. What about those who need treatment, though, to survive? Call for Action problem solver Carice Jackman tells us more about health, what health officials recommend for people, especially, Carice, those with kidney problems. That's absolutely right, Tracy. You know, so many technicians and people working at dialysis clinics are working around the clock to help people out, especially those with kidney failure. On a personal oh. note, you know, my father passed away from kidney failure back in 2014. And what a lot of patients have to do, just like him, they have to go out three times a week to get their blood circulated. It is a matter of life and death. So officials want you to remember to go out and get your treatments, but only go out to get your treatments. If you need anything else, call somebody that is healthy to in, in order to get some of the supplies that you need. Remember to tell those people if they're going out to get your supplies, ask them to get enough for two and a half weeks so that you do not have to go outside. And remember, check your healthcare professional, check with them if you have any questions about your medication too. According to the National Kidney Foundation, dialysis centers were provided with guidance from Centers for Medicare and Medicaid Services with what protocols to take to help keep patients and workers safe. Now, Dr. Heather O'Hara ran with Meharry Medical College, talked about it with us. Here's what she had to say to us today. Unfortunately, without dialysis, that can lend itself to also demise as well. If there are things that they have, that they have going on that don't really require in-person medical care, they should be calling their doctor, trying to get things done over the phone, or at, with some places having telemedicine actually set up, they should be using telemedicine. Again, it's so important to make sure that you still go out and get your treatment, only that, and head back home. Also remember to make sure that you take foods with low salt and low potassium as well. Back to you ladies in the studio. Interesting stuff. All right, Carice Jackman, thank you.